Yo, oh my gosh. Whoa, I've got a lot of light coming on. Hold on. Yeah, there's a cord. Okay. Y'all, season six, episode one. Oh my gosh. So, like, I wasn't expecting Trader Johan to just, like, immediately, like, I was, I was not expecting him to just crack the way he did. Not, not crack, but, like, so, like, towards the end of the episode, he just, like, finally, like, just tried to stab Toothless in the back, quite literally, and I was like, yo, you have been working on this for years, and you are done. But, like, also, oh my gosh, what an episode. Um, so, we find out that Trader Johan has been paying Vigo, and he's been paying, um, he's been paying Krogan, and I'm just like, oh my gosh. Like, I expected that he was higher ranked, but didn't expect that. So, like, that was, oh my gosh, that was so cool. And then, not only that, but we also, like, when, when uh, Hiccup was putting together the pieces of how long Trigger Johan has been actually backstabbing them, um, it all made sense, which I have to say, I was really glad that the writers unraveled it that way because I had always wondered, I was like, why is Trader Johan always here at the most convenient of times? And quite honestly, there are a lot of like writers out there that are like, ah, oh, conveniency of plot. So I was afraid it was just conveniency of plot, but no, it was strategic of the character being a villain. And it made so much more sense. It confirmed some things for me. It also confirmed that the writing team for How to Train Your Dragon Race to the Edge is on point. It is fabulous, and I love them from the depths of my soul. Oh my gosh. It's just fabulous. Um, so this was a lovely episode. This was, it was great to see the twins suspect each other of treason because, like, you know that they're just goofing off, but, like, they actually are suspecting each other of treason. Like, there's a spy on some rings. It must be one of us. And so, like, they just keep whipping at all these different weapons trying to get each other with, and I'm just like, y'all, y'all are being silly. I can't handle the goofiness right now. Uh, so this was a great, a really great episode. It's really hard to iron and to watch TV at the same time. I struggle with multitasking. I'm one of those people that I'm like, I gotta give everything my 100% attention. Like, I just really struggle with multitasking. So it's hard to be ironing and watching this at the same time. But it's worth it, because I am adulting, and I am doing things, and now I'm doing reviews, and also ironing my clothes, and keeping up with this new season. So I'm super excited. Spoilers galore. This show is lovely. I love it. So, that's my thoughts so far. I've got all of this to get through within like an hour or two and then vacuuming because I'm having a friend come over tonight to surprise my roommate. Alrighty, so, that's my thoughts so far. It's lovely. Let's continue on with this series.